<gasps> That's not a pig. Sheep machine, you did not see that. <laughs> I'm so sorry, dude. <laughs> I saw a pink and I just said pig. Uh, sorry for my bad behavior. Uh, I know you're mad with me. Wait, wait, come on. Please listen to me. Please, please let me put away the sword. Sure. Sorry. Please forgive me. I did not mean to hit you in the butt with my sword. Hey, it's KMA. How's your day today? And welcome to the corner. I'm actually thinking of changing that because, um, now I think I'm going to say, Hey, it's KMA. Be better today than you were yesterday. And better tomorrow than you are today. Because that's basically what we want. We want growth. Growth positively. But <laughs> forget that. We are a squirrel. We are going to start a new single player world called KMA Plays because 1.1.3. It's been a while since I've had my own single player series, but I'm going to have three Minecraft series going at the same time. They're going to be released Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So uh, game mode survival world options. I'm not doing anything weird. Uh, bonus loud cheats? Nope, nope. I thought there was something. Uh, okay, we're just going to do a... Um, a strange world, a whole new world is loading up very slowly. As um, I just got home, and for some reason I'm wired. I don't know why. It's hot outside. It's very hot outside, and um, I should be dead tired, but I'm wired. I'm just probably just happy to be home from work. Anyways. This world, I haven't really thought about it. As you saw, I did not have a seed. I'm gonna just deal with the location that has been given th to me. And you know what? This location that has... <gasps> that sheep. That sheep. Sheep. Oh, 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 I gotta name that sheep. That sheep's gonna be the icon of this world. Let me, uh, the uh, sounds are okay, music off, weather. All right, I should have done that before I came on, but shh, you didn't know that. So I have no idea what's in this world. I chose a random world. And uh, before I do anything of any spectacular uh, notices, I have no plans. I'm just gonna wing the world. Um, the ultimate goal is to have a double chest of all items possible, including things like gas tears. Oh, that hurts. Oh, I'm not going to have like double uh, chestfuls of protection three books and double chestful of protection four books. That's just stupid. But stackable items, uh, yeah. Double chest full, and that's my goal of each one. And right, right now, we're working on the wood one. No, um, so this, I guess, is spawn. It looks pretty, pretty decent, as I say, for spawn. Um, I have no idea what's over these hills. If this is just an island surrounded by lots of water, but and I'm pretty happy with the way it looks right now. So I am gonna um, not put you through the hassle of watching me punch wood uh dig out coal and kill a couple of cows get some iron armor get all the things that i want that people sometimes show in the first episode but you know if you're watching minecraft uh how many times have you seen it under you know i gotta I've just been talking and punching wood. Normally after <laughs> after like my first tree, I just get all my, uh, I start getting stone. But anyways, I'm going to go and uh, establish myself. I will not build anything other than like a temporary base, probably in a hole somewhere. And then I will uh, go from there and see what happens. Because um, like I say, <laughs> this looks really good. And that sheep. Oh my god, that sheep, I hope, stays there for the entire series. I am, that is, one of my, I, I have to say this, one of, one of my good friends online, I've never met in real life, but friends online are just as good as friends, you know, in real life. 
He's a really awesome person. He's, his name's Sheep Machine, and he's got a sheep mascot here for me. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to go get some things done, and I will be right back. Oh, my. Um, right over there, like that blocks, those um, stones right there is where I spawned. And so I just went over this hill, and there's the swamp here, which is pretty awesome. Oh, and there's a desert here, which is pretty awesome. <gasps> and there is a savanna here. What is... What? What, what, what is that? Wait a second. I look like a bone thing. Oh no, it's just sand. <laughs> I was thinking that was like uh, I've been playing too much modded lately. I was thinking that was some sort of a uh, fossil on on the surface. I'm like, did they add that? So if you don't know, I haven't been following what's been really going on in Minecraft. Um, the updates and stuff. I uh, I saw that they were bringing in dolphins, and I'm like, oh, this is going to be a really cool update, so I'm not going to bother, um, ooh. well, I'm not going to bother with really paying attention to it, because I want to be surprised once I start playing it, and I, I have no clue what a lot of the new stuff is, um, but I guess I will be finding that out soon enough, so I'm going to, um, like I say, I'm gonna start establishing myself. I'm like, right now, I'm trying to get some food because it's almost night time. That's cool. Let's see if there's anything around this corner. There's some more. I can, I can get some pigs. I got something over there. Another. Oh, and there is a f village. I'm not gonna do that now because it's getting dark out and I don't want to uh, get those guys attacked by. <gasps> That's not a pig. Sheep machine, you did not see that. <laughs> I'm so sorry, dude. <laughs> I saw pink and I just said pig. Uh, sorry for my bad behavior. Uh, I know you're mad with me. Wait, wait, come on. Please listen to me. Please, please let me put away the sword. Sure. Sorry. Please forgive me. I did not mean to hit you in the butt with my sword. I will be nicer to your brethren later on. Okay? I am so sorry. Have a good night. I'm gonna run back home now so I can not die out here. Bye bye. All right, guys, I've done some stuff and things. As you see, I do have some armor. I have some phantom membrane. I don't know what to do with this stuff yet, but the phantoms have been coming after me. I got some food and some stuff. So um, I really haven't done anything massive yet. Let me just show you what I've done um, since the last time I recorded. This is the area that I was actually spawned in on. I was spawned like right near that crafting table. And I came over here to cut down some trees. And um, I have decided to make an area over here. This was where I initially got my first set of cobble. It's trying to make it a little difficult to enter. So this is where I got my first set of cobble. And Stuff like that. <clears throat> Some eggs going. And uh, I decided to make uh, this tunnel going down to, you know, the normal um, mine. Because, you know, I do like to mine a lot. It's kind of like one of the things that I do on my free time. You know, I'm sitting around. What should I do? I'll, I'll go mining. So I think I'm going to uh, um, widen this down up to three wide. But this won't be my main mining area but I dug it out to um, I think it was uh, let's see 70 67 blocks that way 67 blocks that way which gives me the length to do um, six wait one two three four five six, yeah six mines on each side that go about 500 blocks I think it was so I've just done that one I haven't done the poke coals coming back because it was such a fruitful um, strip mine that, that I I stopped. I, didn't, I got diamonds and I got a whole bunch of other stuff. So um, that's how this area is being set up. This won't be my main uh, mining area, but it is a good place to start. And I wanted to, I forget if I did it offline. I probably did do it offline, but initially, but initially, I, um, yeah, I wanted to at least get the first diamonds I saw 
with you guys. Those are the first diamonds I ran into, but I did end up getting diamonds someplace else because uh, I was playing a lot on my own between recordings here because this is, I mean, it's not a huge amount to be done. Let's see what we got. Stoned, and an ore. Isn't there an ore place? Yeah, so the, we got a 14 diamond, which is pretty good. We're playing this at one sitting. So, um, what I wanted to show you, because this is a brand new world, and something that you guys should do, if you don't think it's too cheaty, um, is I made the fishing farm area. It comes around here, and it goes down there, and that's all the fishing I've done so far, because I haven't had a um, replacement uh, fishing thing come through. And it, it's pretty simple. I, sh I showed this on a Mr. Craft. Um, a server video. It's just basically you put a fence on top of a, a hopper with a pressure plate on top and put a hole on the other side so when you put the water down the water goes towards the hole and falls into the hole and you just stand here and the weight of the pressure plate will open that up and the bobber from when you're fishing will do that. Uh, I just don't have a fishing rod on me right now when you catch something that goes into that and then it goes into this chest array and that's basically it so that's what i'm gonna do i am going to um prepare to go fishing i have been attacked uh numerous times by the phantoms everybody thinks they're really scary and stuff i think i think if you're not prepared for them they they are I imagine if you're not ready for them and they swing down and scare you, yeah, they're they're tough to deal with. But what I'm gonna do is I am gonna um, get ready for work. And while I'm at work today, I'm gonna do this fishing farm and hopefully I have this one protected. Last one uh, on Mr. Craft just got blown up last night and uh, I don't know why, but as you see the Something would have to jump a big distance to get into this area. So I guess one, two, three, four, five blocks. And I don't think a mob would be able to jump that distance. Maybe they could jump sideways over there, but they don't usually jump sideways. There's an opening right there. That's where the fishing farm is. You can see it open to the sky. But uh, I'm going to go to work and get some fishing done. And I will show you what is then and some more stuff for what i am going to look forward to be doing in this series and the future so i look forward to it and let's get some fishing done hopefully i get a real fishing pole and get some major fishing done see you soon i've been working on the um fishing farm and trying to get like myself a good pole and as you see there is not a single pole in here the the gods of fishing have not been on my side. I need a pole that has uh, mending so I can sit here all night long and fish. But I'm not getting that, um, which is kind of frustrating. I'm still in my little old hole, and there's a little sheep that's going to be the mascot. I think I might give him a little field up there so he can wander around other than just on that one block. He's going to stay up there. I'm going to give him his own little home and... And maybe a wife, I don't know, or a husband, depends on what he wants or she wants, I don't know. I haven't been close enough to check to see what it is. Um, so, what I've been really doing, basically, is I've been throwing on a video, sticking the ball out into the water, and just like, uh, waiting and waiting, and hopefully one of these times I will get a pole a fishing pole i'll catch a fishing pole with some sort of mm, let's see enchant on it but no that hasn't been happening as you see these are other things i've been caught in my thing so i thought okay may let's be smart let's just go like this and enchant a fishing pole and maybe i'll just get something awesome um what you can't enchant fishing poles? What? Wait, wait, wait. You can't enchant fishing poles in... 
and enchantment tables? What? Is that new? Has that always been a thing? I am completely confused now. I thought that was a thing. Hmm. So I don't know if that's a bug or if I'm just misremembering. Then I thought, well, you know, I have a crap ton of iron down here. Unlike the Mysticraft world, I actually have iron here. And uh, yeah, I'll just uh, make an anvil and throw one of my wonderful books on it and make it what uh, <laughs> to like an awesome fishing pole, but I've only gotten two books. That's not gonna help the fishing pole. Well, that kind of sucks for a fishing hole, too. So, I've been relegated to just hanging out and going like this. And thinking about my texture pack, going, hmm. You know, the splashes aren't right. Hey, where's my bobber? What happened to my bobber in 1.113? There's a lot of things wrong with my texture pack, which I'm going to have to, like, work on fixing. And I've been trying to, like, fish with something to get me interested. Like, I don't have any blocks above my head when I fish, like, right here on this block. Right there. Uh, hence the little difference there. And, you know, I figure, you know, at least when I'm fishing and just, like, goofing off and doing nothing that... Maybe I'll be lucky enough and I get attacked by some phantoms and I get some phantom membrane or whatever that membrane is called. It's been like four or five days and no phantoms have come to try and bite my head. So, um, I don't know what's going on. Is, is it just because I discovered up a lot by blocks? If I was like out know, in the middle of this water, I would be attacked by the phantoms? I don't know. But, I don't know. This is a very weird world. I'm just going to say it. It's, it's, it's not the, the most exciting world ever. Well, it's not a horrible world either. I mean, come on. It's beautiful. It's, look at this. And little full moon. Give me a fishing pole, you dumb bum. At least a fishing pole with some sort of mending on it. At least I can manage to get the other stuff once I get the fishing pole's mend mending. I want to be able to put the weights on my mouse and walk away from the computer for eight hours and come back and have lots of good things. But no. I'm sitting here with Squidward and his brother looking at this water with unnatural... Water elements bouncing up and down, catching lots of cod. Yes. So I think that's what they call these things now, right? Cod? Salmon? Cod. Yeah. It's cold. It's cold. I took off my texture pack and it had that weird cod texture pack. What I'm going to have to do is I'm... I am just going to have to um, take a 1.13 faithful texture pack and begin with that so I have everything under the right size because there's other things that are a little messed up with this texture pack which um, including horses I can't see horses horses are invisible for some reason I see their hoofs and I see their nose <laughs> and everything else gone so I obviously have a lot of work to do on this texture pack so one of these days I'm just gonna sit down and figure exactly what I need on this texture pack and I'll fix it Oh, speaking of phantom, about time, guys. Hi. Welcome to KMA's Let's Play World. Come here. Come here. Come here. Screw the fiction. No. Oh, uh, I don't. Okay, let's let's go someplace so they can attack me. Where's up? Oh, no, not in here, you goofball. Get out of my home. This is my home. Home. Me. Thank you. No membrane. All right, let's replace the thing. Um, I think the scariest thing about these guys is their voice. Let's 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 go out and 
make it over to uh, an area. Hopefully there's no creepers over here. There's a couple of creepers. Come on, let me, let me get to the island first, you dummy. I saw you coming. I have eyes behind my head. Come here, dudes. Dudes, dudes, come on. I'm right here. Come on. Come on, like, this is really going to scare me. Come on. Yeah, okay. Come on. Oh, you got me, you jerk face. There's no creepers? No creepers. Come on. Give me... Give, I want one. I want one. Give me a membrane of yours. You scaredy cat, dudes. Really, you, you need to be, um... Trained. You know, I I can go find a, a nice, nice phantom. And... It sounds like there's one to my right, too. There is a, a membrane. Okay. Whoa! Dude. Give me that membrane. Um, I can find a nice phantom that can teach you how to attack. A little bit better than this, because, come on. It's not like I'm... I'm protected up to the... The quilts and this stuff. And you can barely, barely... You're hitting, like, a half a heart of damage on me. That's, like, um... It's okay. But, come on. I want you to, like, be able to throw me on your back and bring me up to 190 f feet into the air and just drop me off. Wouldn't that be cool if a phantom could pick you up and, like, uh, bring you up into the sky and just drop you? Well, I better not give him ideas. That, that would be kind of cool. Come here, creeper. Creeper? Yes. Come here. Come here. Do me a favor. Thank you. I don't have to worry about him later. But man, I think I was a little bit closer than I thought. I wanted to get rid of a heart or two, not get down to one or two hearts. I'm well done with phantoms. I don't know if they'll come back later on tonight because I'm still up or whatever, but it doesn't matter. I'm going to have to get myself a fishing pole. We're going to get some food service going, and we'll figure out what we're going to do next week on this um, series. But uh, guys, thank you for watching this. Uh, sorry the last little part was drawn out a little bit longer than it should have been. But I was a little upset because I didn't get what to do what I wanted to do, which is something other than fishing. But, guys, I can't wait to see what happens with the rest of this series. Remember, be a better person today than you were yesterday, and a better person tomorrow than you are today. Continual growth. Perpetual growth. Yes. That's the key. Have a great day, guys. Goodbye.